So I'm Zach Maritas. I started working on this application when I was a sophomore at Duke University. It was really born out of my experience as a student athlete. I mean, I, I struggle with time management and wanted, like many entrepreneurs, wanted to build a solution to that problem. The idea of being on time and communicating with his team helped Zach on and off the field. It also helped keep the offensive lineman from spending his college years on the steps of Wallace Wade Stadium. So when you're a college football player, and this is probably not just Duke most places, you know, when you show up later, you forget something, the, the most common punishment is running stadium stairs. And I was redshirted my freshman year, which meant I wasn't going to be setting any records on the football field, but I just might have set the record for the most stadium stairs run by a freshman in one semester. So um, certainly there was some physical motivation to find a solution to that problem. Once a rough version of the application was up and running, Zach and his teammates were organized and communicating properly. Eventually, all of Duke's athletics programs began using the application in addition to the football team. The area where we use it most is in actually strength, strength and conditioning or sports performance. Um, we put in for all of our guys each summer how they've done in that past year. Um, so we constantly have a chart of how they're performing in the weight room, how they're doing stuff on the field drill-wise. After graduation, Zach did not run with his idea full time. Instead, he and his co-founder worked for another software company before finally taking the leap of going into business full time in 2010. Started with just two people, it was myself and my co-founder, Sean Powell. Um, Sean was my technical co-founder. I mean, really, you know, where I had uh, worked on a very basic prototype on the front end, Sean was the technological genius that really took this to um, its full potential. The result of concentrating on their product was that Northwestern University became a client. Over time, multiple universities and professional sports teams have been added to the client's list. Across all of these groups was the same issue that reached beyond simple logistical and scheduling communication. When we started digging into these communication issues, you know, the, the first response is, hey, you have a large group of people that aren't communicating, collaboration platform. Not a new concept, but most of the tools that are out there most of the scheduling and information sharing tools were designed for a sedentary workforce, people that are sitting in front of a computer terminal. Well, athletics couldn't be farther from that, right? Your, your coaches are up on their feet coaching, they're on the road recruiting, your athletes are all over campus, trainers, strength staff, everyone's very, very mobile. And so they needed a solution that was gonna reach them where they were, not back at the desk that they check into twice a day. One of my roles for my position is to uh, make sure that everybody's on page and um, we've got 120 guys on the, on the football team right now, so uh, text messages is, is, is the way to go. Um, you got guys in class, you got guys in tutoring sessions, you got guys working out, so calling them all the time is, it definitely doesn't work. Now programs that compete against Duke are also clients. NC State and UNC Football used a mobile and desktop program to get their players, coaches, and trainers on the same page. Zach says that the rivalries on the field does not mean that his software should not still be available to everyone off the field. For those 60 minutes that we were playing Carolina, they were our bitter enemies, but then after the game, you, you have to respect what they're doing, and I respect greatly the administrators and the athletes and what they're all striving towards at, at Carolina and Duke and, and NC State. and. Um, you know, at the end of the day, they all have the same mission. Now the software has even been adopted outside of athletics. It is taking the small business headquartered in downtown Durham to a national business and sports industry audience. We have a few transportation companies, one in Illinois that's got several thousand school bus drivers on it. Uh, we've got another transportation company up in uh, New York City, um, a couple of retail companies, one I think we've all heard of, Adidas. Um, you know, I, I, there are very clearly uh, applications for this system in other industries. 